I was finally able to get a hold of our Arsa Mini 4.6 case. So what you see now is literally 30 minutes after I received it and opened. I just upda updated the firmware on the Arsa Mini 4.6 case and went to a local trail and shot these footage. Like promised, I'm going to be comparing these two cameras like I did before with the Sony a7S II and Micro Cinema camera. The GH5 is $2,000, so I went below to the Micro Cinema camera, which is $900 and I went a little bit above the GH5, which is 2995 for the Sony a7S2, but now I'm gonna go shoot a little bit higher at the 4995 on the R74.6K. So it's gonna be really interesting on how the GH5 is gonna do. Like always, if you have any tests that you want me to do, just let me know uh, and we'll see what we can do. I'm gonna be taking these cameras to a summer trip. It's gonna be really exciting. You're gonna see a lot of tests from both these cameras. It's gonna be awesome. But for this footage here, uh, I'm gonna talk about it a little bit more. Let's talk about lens. Uh, I shot it with the Sigma 18 35 millimeter with a um, UV filter, no IR cut or no ND filters. So yeah, I have that. And um, the R74.6 k was shot at 4.6K raw, 24 frames per second. And then the GH5 was shot with V-Log at 24 frames per second, 10 bit. Uh, color profiles, I added the LUTs in DaVinci Resolve. So for the Ursa Mini 4.6K, I just used the default uh, Ursa Mini 4.6K to Rec. 709. And the GH5, I used the Vericam uh, a Log to Rec. 709 because I wanted to see, I really wanted to see how these cameras will perform at their base, are they base LUTs or base look. I didn't do any lift gamma gains until the very end with the slow motion. But for these, for the rest of these videos with the raw and then the LUTs ap applied later on, they're just as is straight from the camera. Now I did provide you guys with the footage for you guys to mess around with. That's always fun to see what other people have done with the footage I'm shooting. But yeah, nothing too interesting here. Just really just shooting a bunch of um, stuff in the woods just to see how the quality looks.